Good morning, or whatever time you happen to be watching this. Today we're going to be smoking some meat. We've got uh, two pork roasts, and we've got a brisket that we're going to be doing. And uh, we are working on that right now. We've got the two pork roasts. I've trimmed a lot of the fat off of, the, of it. We've got the brisket. Uh, we have taken and tried to dry them off a little bit. And we're about to start seasoning. So we're going to be using good old French's mustard and some Suckle Buster's barbecue rub. So we're going to get that ready and then this is going on the smoker. On a cook like this, you got to get your hands dirty. So let's uh, get her going. A little mustard. Rub it in, all around on the sides. This will hold the uh, seasoning on there. And so, you wanna make sure you get, get it covered good. Do the same with both. These are bone in, really doesn't matter whether you've got the bone in or bone out, but uh, we're planning on having a little barbecue meat tonight. We'll fix this up and then we can pull it, put it in the fridge, we'll have it to eat. Probably since we've got so much of it we're doing at one time, we'll probably end up freezing some of it so that we can have it later. We're going to do the same thing with the brisket. Get the ends of it. pretty good on that. Now we'll go down with our seasoning. Get it on both sides and we'll rub it on the ends. that one to the side. We'll do the same with the roast. Be sure and get them good and covered up. All right. 
Alright, that was looking good. Wash my hands and then we'll get it to the smoker. Alright, using our new Cuisinart smoker for the first time. We've got our wood chips down in here. We've got our water added. Uh, we just turned it on, so we're going to get it smoking hot. And uh, then we'll add the pork. Using our B&B 100% natural wood smoking chips. This is pecan, cherry, and post oak. Alright. We've got the roast on top, the brisket's on the next level, and it's cooking time. We've got the brisket off. It is done. Uh, the roast still needs to go for a little bit, but we're going to wrap it in aluminum foil and we'll put it back in the smoker. Uh, we're going to just wrap the other uh, and leave it and let it just continue to cook. Roast is about to go back in the smoker and the brisket will sit on the counter. Roaster back on. We'll let it go for about another two hours probably and then we'll give it a try. I just pulled one off one of the pork roasts off of the smoker and it is just falling apart. I wanted to check one first and then I'm going to go get the other one off of the smoker. But this is looking good. Get the bone out of the way. There's one pork roast. I'm about to go get the other. There's the second pork roast, and where it is steaming hot, and yes, it is pulling apart. Look at there. And it's hot. A big bone on this one. This will be good eats. Here is the brisket that we smoked. We're gonna slice it up. Yeah, and it's delicious. Hang on, have I tasted the brisket yet? That looks good. I think I'll give it a try. That's right, tasty. We're going to finish cooking this or slicing this up, and it'll be time for dinner. That's a good looking brisket right there. Man's Adventures. Barbecue came out really good. And uh, let us know what you think. If you have comments on how to do it better, please let me know. God bless.